Hello, my name is Maryam Al Ansari, a student in the Department of English Language and Literature at the University of Bahrain. Welcome to our Advanced Grammar Series. In this video, I will be talking about negative words. The following slides will discuss negative words, no and none, when can no be used, no or not, when can not be used, and finally, none of and how it can be used. When we want to say that something is not true or is not the case, we can use negative words, phrases, or clauses. Negation can happen in a number of ways, most commonly when we use a negative word, like no, none, nobody, no one, and nothing. They can be used with positive verbs. For example, there was nothing to eat in the hotel room, so none of us has had breakfast yet. We can use these negative words as subjects with positive verbs. For example, no one complained and nobody told us. But we can't say not anybody told us, nor can we say nobody didn't tell us. How are negative words used? Usually, when expressing negative concepts, we normally use negative verbs like wasn't and haven't. For example, there wasn't anything to eat in the hotel room so we haven't had breakfast yet. No and none. We use no before nouns and none instead of nouns. For example, didn't you bring any money? The answer would be, I have no money or I have none. We don't normally use double negatives. We can't say I don't have no money, nor can we say I don't have none. When can no be used? No can be used with both singular and plural nouns or a gerund to emphasize the negative. The following structures can be used instead of negative verbs. So instead of saying, one class doesn't have a teacher, you can say, one class has no teacher. Or instead of saying, cameras aren't permitted inside the court, you can say, no cameras are permitted inside the court. Or as shorthand for is or are not allowed in formal situations. For example, no dogs, no skateboards, no talking during exams, and no parking. We use do plus verb rather than no plus gerund in formal situations. For example, don't park there. No or not. No or not can be used with comparative adjectives. These seats are no better than the others. These seats aren't any better than the others. No or not can also be used with adverbs. We should leave no later than 8.30. Or we shouldn't leave any later than 8.30. When can not be used? We use not rather than no in reduced negatives. Do you want to keep these boxes or not? If not, I'll just throw them out. Not is also used before the indefinite article a or an. For example, a whale is a mammal, not a fish. Another example would be, not a single drop of blood was split. It is also used before quantifiers such as all or a lot. For example, not all Americans are rich. Another example would be, there is not a lot to be gained by being rude to people. And finally, none of and how it can be used. None of is used before pronouns and determiners, like the, those, our, etc. For example, none of them understood it. None of our friends will come. None of the lights are working. And in formal situations, None of is sometimes used with plural verbs. Example, none of them are working. Thank you for listening.